Hi guys, welcome to Crafty Fairy Godmothers. This is the first tutorial for our next BAMP project um, over on the minis. I'm going to show you today how to make the base page. Now for this base page you're going to need two sheets of A4 cardstock. Um, this is quite a hefty card as you can hear. Um, it's going to have a lot of um, flaps and pockets and things attached to it so I would recommend that you use a good strong base page. Um, I would say this is probably at least three, uh, 300 GSM. Right now, first thing you're going to need to do is to cut your first piece down to 8 by 8. So, 8 by 8. Put that to one side and the next piece you're going to want to cut at 9 by 6. Um, six, no, six, I'm sorry, nine by six and a half. That's right, yeah, nine by six and a half. Now, don't throw these pieces away, you're going to need those for your add ons. Now, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to score. Now, actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to score using my um, trimmer because a lot of you haven't got school boards so I'll do it with my trimmer now with the longest edge to the top you're going to come across and you're going to score at half an inch I'm going to do that both sides because as I say this is quite strong card Be careful you don't pop out, which I just did then. Now you're going to do that on both sides, so half an inch on each end. Okay, right. trim all away. going to want to do is you're going to fold over those ends and give them a good burnish down now we're going to attach this to the larger piece like that so it's at one end so you've got it's going to form a pocket one side is going to be for our binding the other side is going to be for the pocket okay so to do that you can either use wet glue or you can use tape for the purposes of the video I'm going to use tape but I would recommend because it's going to be quite a heavy mini I would recommend you use wet glue so I'm going to put tape on both sides Good rub down. Now peel off one side only first. Check that you don't have any overlay of your tape, so push it over. Some of you may like to do your tape of your corners. Just take a little bit off of there. Should have done it on this side before I took the top off there. Right now, we're going to line it up right on the edge. The light in here is terrible at the moment, so 
and you're going to stick that down. Okay, very good. And then you peel off and then you stick the other side down, making sure that you've got this bottom edge lined up too. You can always go round afterwards and trim off any overlay. That is our base page completed. This is going to be the, where we use our binding and that's the opening to the pocket. Now, I'm going to show you two methods of binding. One, which is what I'm going to use to make the actual mini, is going to be um, Laura Dennison's Stack the Deck. Um, and it's also the same, basically the same as uh, Kathy Alter's Hidden Hinge. Um, and I'm also going to show you how you can use, add binding, a binding strip to use for your binding rings. Okay, guys. That's the base page. Now you're going to need to make six of these. Okay. I'll see you in part one of the builder page. See you soon. Bye.